Hey everybody, just want to welcome you to my YouTube channel. I will come out with a video in a uh, few days uh, describing what my channel will actually be about and uh, a lot of information. But anyhow, I want to share a photo session I did uh, just a few days ago with Jenny O'Neill, the model that I brought in to do some work at MPW Studios. And uh, let's take a look at it. Are we ready? Let's do it. Okay, everybody, uh, name's Steven Owatarski, photo artist. I'm here at Midwest Photography Workshop in their studio, Farmington Hills, Michigan, for new people if you didn't know that. And I'm gonna be working with uh, Jenny. By the way, can you use a different name? No, that's Okay, me. this is Jenny O. That's fine. All right, and uh, we're doing a concept shot. Actually, I'm gonna do a composite. I wanna come up with at least a couple artworks. And uh, a lot of people ask me, how do I shoot uh, for a composite. In other words, when I shoot the subject, do I have a background in mind that I'm going to use or do I just shoot the subject and find a background? And the correct answer to that is yes, I do both. Okay, so right now I've got some ideas what I'm going to use, uh, but it's not definite. So you're going to see me that when I shoot, I'm going to shoot Jenny here and down here because the background, I don't know where my horizon is going to be. And when you do a composite, you need to match that. So if my horizon's up here, then I have to choose the shots that are right there. Okay, if the horizon is lower, I'm choosing the shot right there. Now the set we're gonna do is, I've got some lights in the back to give her some edge lighting. Got an 8200 Godox strobe up there with a um, shoot, uh, not a shoot through umbrella, reflective umbrella to come back to fill her in on the front side. And then um, after I get done with that, I'm gonna shut the lights off and then I'm gonna do the same set. And the reason I'm doing that is, if my background has light behind it, like explosions or fires or something like that, then she's gonna be backlit. So that's why I want the edge lighting. If it's not, I don't want the edge lighting and I just want normal front lighting. So that's why uh, I'm doing uh, those sets, doubling up on that. All right, with that out of the way, let's do it. All right. I hope. Okay, so I'm gonna have you do a power shot like that. Okay, now so I'm taking about your shoulder height. Now I'm gonna go lower. Perfect. All right, give me a really badass mean look now. Power like this. Do you want this down? Uh, no, no. Okay, hold that to the side. You know, like in the front, like this. Yeah, there you go. And then, yeah, there you go. Kick the hip out. Really badass look. Like, you got to get past me if you're going to get to the fort. Okay, now I want you to do like an attack. Like you're going to, I would say you're going to be more like this and coming right at me like that. But I'm going to have you drop the sword down lower. Yeah, there you go. Perfect. Now what I want you to do is scream at me. Ah! Shit, not bad. Sorry. Scared that. <laughs> I'm a singer. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. Ready? One, two, three. Do it again. Ah! Perfect. All right. I think we're good. Now I'm going to shut the lights off and do a different set. I'm not going to record this, but she did an awesome job. <laughs> oh, shit. Was it not recording? Yeah, it was. Oh, it was. Hey everybody, just wanted to go over a couple of the uh, images that I shot uh, with uh, Jenny. And I had a bit of a problem because when I got done and I came back and I started looking at the images, uh, my goal was to do two different art pieces uh, in Photoshop. And the problem I had was she was so darn good <laughs> that I probably, probably will end up doing about four to five pieces of art uh, work. Uh, I'm gonna show you actually two of them. Um, I just don't have time to show the other three because obviously I haven't done it yet. But it looks like I'm going to probably do another two to three more because of 
uh, just the shots and the way things came out. So anyhow, let's take a look at the first one. This is the one that had that sort of like badass type look, protecting an area, uh, the shot. And um, this is what I came up with uh, in Photoshop. So that was my finished piece. Uh, not bad on that one. I was pretty proud of that piece of work. And then the um, second shot that I liked was this shot right here. And uh, after I took that and threw it into Photoshop, I came up with this as a finished piece. And uh, it's got a little bit of haze in the background, some fire smoke going on right there. And then uh, I think the next one I'm going to do probably will be two to three more. But uh, just to show you, the next one I'll probably grab is uh, this one right here. And this is where she was actually yelling and um, didn't expect her to yell that loud. It scared the crap out of me. Uh, it was louder than what it was recorded, by the way. So uh, we had a big laugh on that. But anyhow, those those are a couple uh, projects, uh, project images, I should say, that I did after uh, that shoot. More to come in the future. Uh, please um, subscribe to my channel. I'm just going to start that now again. So if you would please, again, subscribe, like this. And uh, of course, it's free again. And grab the notification bell. Click on that because, again, when I upload a new YouTube video, you'll get notified on that. All right, guys. Thanks a lot.